Hey guys, welcome to the video today. This is the Logitech M510 Comfort Plus mouse. And in today's video, I'm going to go through some troubleshooting steps if this mouse is not working. But before we begin, I wanted to let you know a couple of different things. First, make sure that you're wearing the proper safety equipment and take all safety precautions while you're trying these troubleshooting steps. And second, I do have a setup and review video on this mouse that I'll link at the end of this video. And if you're interested and have time, please check that video out. Okay, so the first thing that we're going to check is the batteries. So if we turn the mouse over, this is the invisible optic and you wanna make sure that you do not point this at yourself or at any other living thing. And then here is the on off switch and you wanna make sure that it's in the off position. And then this is the battery cover and I'm just going to gently press down right here and slide the battery cover down like this until it comes off like so. And we'll just set this to the side for now. And then here are the batteries and there's a tab right here. So if we lift up on this tab while holding on to the mouse with the other hand, the battery comes up like so, the first one does. And then we can take this battery out. I'm just going to set that right here for now. And then if we just gently lift up on the tab again while holding onto the mouse with the other hand, the second battery will come up a little bit too, and then we can lift this battery out as well. And then here is the inside of the battery compartment. And on the tab, it tells you what type of batteries these are. These are AA batteries, and it also tells you the direction that the batteries need to be installed. So you wanna make sure that the batteries are installed the correct direction. And if they were installed the correct direction, you can try installing two new AA batteries. And if you do install two new batteries, make sure that you store your old batteries in a safe place until you can take them to the proper recycling facility. Okay, so I'm going to reinstall these batteries into this mouse. These batteries are okay. Um, and you just want to make sure that you install them the correct direction. So here is the minus sign on this side, and then here is the plus sign on this side. So uh, we know which direction it goes into the mouse here. So I'm just going to put the minus sign side in first, and then you just have to gently press the battery in like this, and the front part will go down like so. And then I'm going to take the next battery and same thing, the minus sign goes into the mouse first like this. And then just gently pressing the battery in and then down until it seats into place like so. And you just wanna make sure that both batteries are seated down into place like so. And then I'm going to take the battery cover and line this back up and then just gently slide it up until it seats back into place like so. And you can test the mouse out and see if it's working. And if it is, that's great. If not, we'll move on to some additional troubleshooting steps. Okay, so for the next troubleshooting step, I'm going to leave the mouse turned on. And this is the Logitech USB unifying receiver. And I'm going to take this out of its current USB port and I'm going to install it into a different USB port. And when you do this, you wanna make sure that it's installed the correct direction and that you install it all the way into place like so. And then you can test the mouse out and see if it's working. And if it is, that's great. And if not, we'll talk about some additional troubleshooting steps. Okay, and when you're all done using the mouse, don't forget to turn it off. And just like we talked about earlier, this is the invisible optic and make sure not to point this at yourself or at any other living thing. And then we're just going to turn the on off switch to the off position. Okay, so if those troubleshooting steps didn't work, another thing that you can try is to install this mouse on a different laptop or computer. And if that works, then you know that you have a problem with the original laptop or computer that this mouse was installed on that's preventing it from working correctly. Another thing that you can try is to go to the official Logitech website and download the Logitech unifying software. And if you decide to agree to the terms of the end user license agreement, you can install the software and see if that fixes the issue. And the last thing that you can try is to reach out to Logitech to see if they have any additional troubleshooting steps that you can try. 
All right, guys, I hope this video has been helpful and thank you so much for watching. And like I said earlier, I do have a setup and review video on this Logitech M510 Comfort Plus mouse. And I'll link that video at the end of this one. And if you're interested and have time, please check that video out. Thank you guys again so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. Have a good one. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment. And if you have the time, check out these other great videos.